So if you own a Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra, you want to get a tempered glass screen protector. One of the words of advice is that try to avoid it because I got one here and you can see this circular mark that is shown here. This is really irritating, um, but on the Amazon itself, they try to not show you. So sometimes it's quite, most of the times it's deceiving, but in fact, this is the reality here. And the thing that really annoys me is that visually, if you scroll up and down and watch some movie clips on a white screen, it feels like you got this single piece of hair stuck on the uh, screen that you can't get it out and also the success rate of reading your fingerprint is is just substantially get reduced it's like up to like down to five to ten percent which is really annoying because you got one of the most expensive phone under the um, foldable uh, phone uh, category and um, what's the point having a phone that flashy phone that cannot read your fingerprint reader that's exactly what you're going to get just because of the tempered glass screen protector not only that on the edge easily it gathered dust you can see it's very messy here and one of the good things i want to point out is that because of the edge uh, attachment uh, you're going to get a very clear screen that's the only thing i want to say but overall it just completely devalues the use of your phone so what i have done is i got a new uh Spigen, uh, film protector which is called neoflex so i pay a bit more money this time and want to want to let you guys know how good this is so let's get into the unboxing so here it goes so first let's get the case off and finally get this screen out as well so what we have here oh, like a liquidy spray okay that's very interesting okay so i can't see any circular marks which is a very good sign assume that's where you take the water out and that's the quick instruction actually so okay and that's the cloth so let's get this out first is there any dust yeah there's some dust here ASMR, huh? huh? Not wet enough. That's better. And on the side as well. That was pretty straightforward. I don't understand why some people online will complain about this. It's a, this is really easy to install, much better than the other one actually, the one that I just peeled off. So the instruction says wait for three minutes to dry. It's been more than three minutes actually, but um, I can see a bit of a pop on the edge or maybe it will get better but i believe this is the military grade uh, screen protector which somehow heals itself as well this is i'm a great fan of military um screen by the way so this seems to be all good to go let's try it out on the case moment of truth brilliant so it fits perfectly on the default uh, samsung protective case so let's see if the fingerprint reader works well Brilliant. Let's try that again. Perfect. That's exactly what I want. So problem solved. So the screen protector is back to normal. I can see that it's not 100% perfect because the way how the screen curves for Galaxy S20 Ultra, there's a slight air gap on the on the edge, but it's more than much better than the other one anyway. And then no, no longer we have this 
annoying circular mark on the fingerprint reader sensor part. So um, all good, but uh, for those who are struggling, what you need to do, the main secret is you put in plenty of water on it. In other words, initially over the, uh, over the whole screen, just apply a little so that it will settle in, uh, make sure you adjust it, make sure that the camera lens is actually on the right position. And then what you need to do is um, lift up the other one half apply plenty of water and do the same to the other half and then scrape out the water inside and then wipe the table of where the water gushed out. So I hope that helped you understand how to apply it. Um, I saw a few people complaining about this and I hope that tip I just gave you uh, helped you to have a perfect screen protector just like what I have here. So I'm very pleased, back to normal, feels like a proper high-tech phone that I've always wanted and I'm really, really happy about it. So if you have any queries, please do comment below and I'll come back to you as soon as possible. Thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.